Cutting back on salt and sodium can lower your risk of high blood pressure, heart disease and stroke. Eating less salt doesn't have to be hard. Here are some easy ways to cut back on salt. Read food labels. Check the nutrition facts for total sodium in packaged foods. When you shop, choose foods that are low in sodium. Less than 140 mg of sodium per serving is considered a low sodium product. Cut back or avoid already prepared foods and fast foods. They are often high in sodium. Look for low sodium frozen or canned foods. Canned foods and frozen foods are often not good for health, so try to avoid them. Avoid high sodium soups, sauces, condiments and prepared mixes. Take the salt shaker off the table. Some more ways to cut back on salt. Eat more fresh vegetables and fruits. Limit the amount of cured meats and deli meats that you eat. Avoid cooking with grease too. Taste food before salting it. Give yourself time to get used to the natural flavors. Look for low sodium recipes. You can leave out the salt in most casseroles, stews and other main dishes. Choose unsalted nuts, seeds and crackers and other snack foods. Add flavor to foods using spices or herbs. But avoid mixed seasonings and spice blends that include salt such as garlic salt. Salt has many names. Salt is also called sodium. It comes in many forms. Some of those include salt that is sodium chloride, baking soda that is sodium bicarbonate, baking powder and monosodium glutamate which is MSG. When reading food labels, look for anything with the word sodium in it. How much salt should you eat? If you eat more salt than you should try cutting back a little at a time. For most people, it is best to aim for no more than 1500 mg per day, about 2 to 3 teaspoons. It is especially important to limit your salt intake if you are over 40 and have high blood pressure. To give you a salt free diet, you can also choose. Many drinks like sports drinks, vegetables, juices and milkshakes which are low in sodium. Try water or other low sodium beverages instead of high sodium drinks. Eat at home. Often, restaurant foods can be high in sodium. When eating out, ask for food to be prepared with less salt or choose lower sodium options such as fresh salads and items without special sauces. Be patient. Your taste buds will soon get used to less salt and your heart will thank you. Cutting back on the amount of salt and sodium in your diet can reduce your risk of heart disease and stroke. Small changes add up to a healthier youth.